Welcome back to Virginia this morning. We work with a talented group of colleagues here at CBS 6. We sure do, and it's been a fun journey learning about all of these creative endeavors they have going. Elijah Hedrick, one of our directors of Virginia this morning, and his wife, Ryan, nice to see both of you. They've turned their passion for music into a new and innovative platform that Richmond can enjoy and certainly vibe to as well. They join us today to talk all about Hear RVA. Really cool to see you guys. This has been a long time coming. Congratulations. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you for having us. I have the first question I have for you both, are either one of you musicians, do you play an instrument? I'm learning how to play bass right now. Okay, good. <laughs> yeah, we're all in various stages of learning. Uh, okay. I play like a little bit of guitar and dabble a little bit in drums. But so, and, and uh, rap too, I yeah, asked yeah. that is because, you know, I played in band my whole life and I played in a, you know, high school band, I played in dance bands and stuff. I don't call myself a musician because I'm not. Sure. Uh, you know, uh, Ellen DeGeneres can dance, but she's not a dancer. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, <laughs> so I love music, and it, what it taught me was the appreciation of that whole state of mind that musicians have. They are artists. And you guys have brought to the front all these Richmond artists. Richmond's thought of as a foodie town, but it's always been a music town. For sure. There's a long history of, of great artists from Richmond specifically, but also Virginia as a whole for like what they've done changing the music industry. Um, you, you go back to like Ella Fitzgerald, mm -hmm. um, then you go to current artists like Jason Mraz, Pharrell Williams, um, you know, the Neptunes, there's Masego, a new artist, but all over Virginia there's artists, but Richmond seems to have like this special mix of something. There's something in the water here uh, yeah. that has like its own vibe and soul to the music. Yeah. yeah, definitely. Elijah and Ryan, why take this next step? I mean, we know how critical it is to have creatives and business have that synergy, but why take this next step to really showcase uh, these developing artists and music scene here in Richmond? I think right now, uh, Richmond is trying to find their true voice and you know, sorry about COVID, but it showed us community and a lot of artists, visual musicians were losing a lot of gigs. So we, when that happened, we wanted to help support them. And so here our VA, because of that, just kind of sprung up. Everybody was like, yeah, we want to help support too. Um, so we were trying to show ways that you can support the local musicians around. It's interesting, something like a pandemic brings out the creative people who find a way to be creative you guys focused in on that and said, we're gonna find a way to help you do that. So tell us a little bit about Here RVA uh, and the actual program. So, okay, so Here RVA is basically, the goal is to help shine a spotlight on the music that's here of all different genres and styles because we just believe in the talent. Now we have various projects that go on. One of them is we created a mixed taste quiz, which if you've ever done like a BuzzFeed style quiz that tells you which Harry Potter house you're in or something like that, <laughs> yeah. it's very similar to that. You take a six question quiz and it gives you a Richmond music playlist that fits your specific vibe. So we have six different playlists that do that. We update them uh, pretty often. So that's one of the projects where we try to get music to people. But our other main project is our new podcast series called Liner Notes. And that debuts uh, at the end of this month, November 30th. And that is where we really get to, oh yeah. <laughs> we, we really get to like talk with the artists and, and get some more context to the music that they've made and how the city has kind of influenced that music. And so, you know, this was something that we planned almost a whole year ago and have been working towards. So we're really excited for people to see. And we talk to some of the greatest artists in this area. We have about a minute left, and I want to ask you a question real quick. Liner Notes, I've seen him on camera. Do we get to see you on camera? Um, you see me handing I'd like, rather gift bags. <laughs> no, I'm so nervous in camera. Um, but I ask a few questions, because I'm curious. I, you know, I don't like being in front of it, but I do enjoy just the Liner Notes and albums. So me asking these questions live is, I don't know, pretty cool. <laughs> And as I understand it, Ryan, you were involved in the heavy lifting of design, a lot of the things that we're seeing on screen. So some incredible talents. And that's what this is about, is bringing those talents in many different facets all together. You guys really excited and seeing it come and it come together in the podcast yes, form? Yes, my college degree is uh, getting some use right now. <laughs> With the animation, so thanks for Yay! Big <laughs> yeah, since I'm not a musician, I got to show up. Uh, visually. <laughs> yeah, very good. Well, I'll tell you what, there is so much talent in Richmond. We're seeing some of it 
displayed here. These are all people that have been on here, RV. Yes, yeah, so this is about half of the first season right here, uh, worth of artists. So you've got Sam Reed, DJ Harrison, Mitchell Evan, Doe Eyes, but we also talked to some people that were helping keep music af uh, afloat during the whole pandemic time and things shutting down. So just a really interesting season. They'll be coming out weekly, the episodes starting November 30th. So I mean, you've got some in the can already ready to go and you're still working. Yeah, we we're, we're try to be ahead of the game, not yeah. behind. That's, that's yeah. the trick, right? <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm so <laughs> proud of you guys and I'm so excited about about what you're doing, it is very important. This is this is infrastructure for Richmond right here. This keeps something that is so important in our city uh, moving along. And thank you both for doing it. Appreciate it. Everybody wants to buy local, shop local, well, listen. Listen, lo listen local. Oh, listen I love that. Local. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan and Elijah, super nice to meet both of you, of course, and have you on the show. Thanks for sharing your project on Virginia this morning. We wish you the continued success with this incredible project. Get ready. The first episode for Hear RVA's video podcast series kicks off Tuesday, November 30th, and will continue to air once a week. For more information, visit hearrva.com. Stay tuned. We'll be right back.